You need to learn the names of the enzymes that break down fats, proteins, and starch, and where you would find them in the digestive system. Amylase, sometimes called carbohydrates, helps to digest starch. Starch is made of long chains of glucose molecules. It might be helpful to think of enzymes as biological scissors that can cut bonds and break molecules apart. Amylase can be found in the saliva in the mouth, so starch digestion starts in the mouth. If you chew bread for long enough and don't swallow it, you will end up with sugars like glucose in your mouth, and the bread could start to taste sweeter. Amylase is also found in the small intestine, and is secreted by the pancreas, where again starch is broken down. Amylase can't operate in the stomach because the pH is too low, and is denatured in the stomach, so no starch is broken down in the stomach. Protease helps to break down proteins into amino acids. Proteases can be found in the stomach, where they can still perform in the low pH conditions. Proteases are also secreted by the pancreas into the small intestine. Lipase helps to break down fats into fatty acids and glycerol. Lipase is secreted by the pancreas into the small intestine. The pH in the small intestine is between 7 to 8 pH. And again, lipase is not found in the stomach, as lipases would become denatured in the stomach. So, starch is broken down by amylase in the mouth and the small intestine. Proteins are broken down by protease in the stomach and small intestine. Fats are broken down by lipase in the small intestine. In the next lesson, we will learn about labelling the digestive system and going through the role of each part.